G'day, it's Matt here from Walpira, Australia again. We've had a couple of people ask us uh, how to centre the gimbal if your yaw is off just a little bit. Um, can be a pain if you're flying around and your yaw is just kicked off to the side. That's probably uh, a little bit dramatic, but it, it can be just a few degrees and it'll be annoying. So what, what I'm going to do is just show you uh, what to do about it. Uh, the first thing we need to do is um, pop the uh, top gimbal bracket off uh, the four rubbers here so you just undo these two safety clips at the front pop the rubbers off and then you'll end up with something like this gimbal over here so this one here you can see that it's got the yaw sensor on the top of it and uh, we need to basically uh, just undo that um, this is the easiest way at least Un undo this this sensor with both screws And what you can do here is just pull this sensor off and then you've got access to the uh, to the shaft of the uh, the gimbal which is, is causing the issues now on the other end of this we need to get around to the side of our gimbal arm and you can see the small hole which I'll point to just in here you want to undo that allen key just slightly loosen it off and now that will allow you to rotate this arm on that shaft. But the reason why we took the top off is because you need to get a pair of pliers or something that will hold this shaft tight enough so that you can turn, turn the below gimbal arm. So what you want to do is basically you can see the indent in this, uh, there's a flat, flat section on this shaft here and um, you want to uh, basically get that flat flat piece uh, central to to the front of the gimbal so as you can see there it's roughly uh, roughly at the front poor video quality but I, I know you can probably see it just um, and you want to hold that there with the pliers and then what you want to do is you want to just be able to rotate the arm and it's hard to show on the video but if you hold that with the pliers and rotate the arm you can actually turn that arm on that shaft and it'll allow you to recenter that uh, that gimbal yaw just a little bit, so you can turn it all the way around, and you can see that the arm's stationary while I'm turning that shaft. So what you want to do is get that shaft in the centre with the flat piece facing forward, and then you want to rotate with the other hand the gimbal arm at the back to make sure that it's pretty central on the on the whole gimbal itself. And then once it's there, you basically just tighten up the uh, the Allen key that's in the side again. Tighten that one up there, and uh, and you'll hold that position. So it's a bit bit tricky while we're holding the camera as well, but uh, but basically hold that top shaft, and that'll allow you to turn that arm on that shaft once you loosen that Allen key. So see how you go with that. Thanks. 